Fair. I have to eventually learn how to play it. Well, I have to believe it's a cross between ping pong and tennis. Yes, I just have to figure out how to play it, if I can do it anyway. Well, there, well. This is Mark Charles Masilli. Hey, everybody. With, us with something really new. exciting from Cuisinart, brand new today. But I helped design. Black Friday sale price. Mark Charles helped design it. This yeah. has a chopping and a grinding button. Yep, so it's auto reverse. And it's from Cuisinart. It's from Cuisinart. So you can make salsa. It's got a locking lid on it. And you can make salsa in seconds in three cups. And here's the, my favorite part. Ready for this? Locking blade. So, David, when you go to pour out your salsa, there's no fear of the blade falling out. Oh, that's great. Isn't that the greatest thing ever? So, I love that. There's the blade. Still in there. You don't have to take it out first. It stays in there. And you can make salsa chunky, too smooth. And you got three cups of capacity, 250 watts. Now, while you're showing that part in the locking yep. blade, how best to clean this? So, we're going to be able to hand wash everything. Um, in just hand wash everything and hand wash. wipe down. Yep. That's okay. what we want to do with that. So you want to talk about colors. I and can, then talk, I about can colors. talk about the locking blade. And I, I I David, I this is something special for me. I actually designed all the colors and named all the colors. All the colors are exclusive, I'm told. Yes. We've never so had So this is exciting. We have this in pewter. Yep. We also have this for you in poppy. This is lapis, which is a fancy word for blue. <laughs> it's kind of periwinkle. And then we have it for you in jade. Yep. This is amethyst. Personal favorite. And this color is called daffodil. Daffodil is my personal favorite. Daffodil. So here's the thing. Do I, you like amethyst or daffodil? Daffodil is my favorite. Daffodil. I named them all. I did all the colors. We've ne Cuisinart does red, white, and black. We wanted to do an exclusive collection for QVC. Mm. This is going to be the first item of many. I've spent a year and a half with Cuisinart designing the products so you could build a kitchen with these exact six colors. Okay. So it's really exciting. Now, one of the things I love about this, it's lightweight. You know, Cuisinart started the first ever food processor, okay? That's what we love about it. Here's the blade technology. Once I put it in, it stays in. Isn't that the greatest? I, it's something really, really intuitive that you really didn't take for granted in other food processes where you have to take the blade out. This locks in. The whole thing is actually so intuitive. You don't have to look at directions. It weighs nothing. And it plugs into the wall, just so you know. It plugs in the wall. It's very, very lightweight. It's got non-slip feet on it, a cord wrap on the bottom, and it's just easy. It's three cups. It's got a pour feature in here. Let's take you to work. To work. I'm going to do hummus. All right. Okay. You just lock in. It will not work unless the the uh, lid is locked in. So I love that face safety. Chop or grind. It goes in one direction versus the other. Now I'm doing this. You hold it down. It's not an on button. And I'm gonna pour some. So it's more like a pull spot. Yep. Pour spot because you want the olive oil to slowly drip in from the top into your hummus. And it just grinds and grinds and grinds. It and also mixes as yes, it grinds. Yes. It pulls everything in. Up. Oh, let's put a little bit more in there. So I love when you're doing a pesto sauce or any kind of vinaigrette. Or this, mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. This is the way to do it. And they, Cuisinart thought about it. It's also the handle to the lid. And then let's see the results. So now instead of buying something from the store, you have all fresh ingredients that take no effort at all. Look at this hummus. I mean, it's a mini chopper. It's three cup capacity. Look and look at that hummus. That hummus is perfect. Is that beautiful? All I get nervous made. every time we do a hummus demo because most um, mixers or choppers will get hung up with hummus. The, the blade will just spin. It Don't won't really mix it. Don't get hung up on your hummus. It doesn't get hung up and here. And the blade and doesn't fall out. And if it gets a little bit dry, add some more olive oil through yep. the drip Always. lid. Now you can decide how to make your hummus. You make it from scratch. You make it homemade. Garlic in there? Yeah, always garlic. I'm a big fan of the garlic. But let's mm, say you want to make red roasted garlic. pepper garlic uh, hummus. You can do that. OK, next we're going to do a tapenade. Put everything on there. We're going to take the lid. Remember, it doesn't work unless you lock the lid. It stays. It's locked on. There's the two buttons. Chop is one direction and grind is the other. Why would you want one versus the other? The blade is in one direction with chop and one blade, uh, the other blade in grind. If you're gonna do, we're gonna do cheese and nuts, you wanna mm. grind those versus chopping them, right? Okay. So with, again, look at the way it's incorporating. It's pulling everything in. This is Cuisinart. They originated the food processor, first and foremost. That's what makes this incredible technology of 250 watts. Great new collection, I'm super proud of it. Took a year and a half to design this product at line, and I'm here to, to actually premiere it with you guys. Can you guess which one is the most popular? Is it daffodil? No, nope, oh. it's what you're touching. <laughs> oh, the poppy. The poppy is the most popular. It's a tomato. I tried to create a color that was not bright, bright red and not too muted red, so it's, that's why I call it poppy. So let me take you through colors as we spoon out that tapenade, which looks delightful, by the way. Beautifully done. Um, Look at that. Don't miss out on pewter. So we have pewter. This red color is called poppy. That's our number one most popular. Then we have lapis, which is the blue. If you want jade, 
I have 1,600 left for the year, only order of the year. Then Amethyst, 1,200 and Daffodil. 1,100 and Daffodil. Very, very popular. Now, Mark Charles, before you yeah. jump in here, yep. that's hunks of Parmigiano-Reggiano? Uh, uh, yep, and I want to grind it versus chopping it. Again, it's, it's, a, it's a matter of what you're, cook, you're doing. If you want to do spices, if you want to do things like um, a coffee, you can actually grind inside of here. But it's going to go in the reverse direction. It's called the Smart Power Reverse blade that Cuisinart came up with. Pulsing it is always great because it actually moves all your food around, brings it in that centrifugal force, brings it through the blade, and does this to your hard, hard Parmesan cheese. Why buy it pre-grated when, in a matter of a couple seconds, you have beautifully done, chopped, and remember that Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> I'll put it Buy on. it in a wedge and then cut it into chunks. And notice the and blade. And put it inside stays in place. your Cuisinart chopper, and that blade is Stay. locking. Lock in, bla lock in place. Love that, right? Okay, so I should have done the. Um, Chef Dave is going to be mad at me because I didn't do the pesto sauce before the cheese, which is over here. So we're going to do the pesto sauce now. Mm. Sorry, David. So, because the pesto sauce is supposed to go on the spaghetti before the cheese. Okay, so I have this pesto. I mean, if you put them both on there, the same, I mean, no, whatever order, it really doesn't matter because it all goes to the okay, same. Okay, we lost power on this one. Did we lose That's power? That's okay, yep. Let's see. Yep, we lost power. So let's go to garlic. All right. And again, look at all those clothes. Oh, we have a little video to show you. Again, what I love is, is how easy it is. I love that locking blade. There's that pour spout top to really gradually put into all your dressings and your sauces. I love, love, love the fact that it can grind, it can chop. It's a hold down button, so it's not going to actually create um, any kind of uh, chopping. Oh, you got it. I put it in another plug. Mm -hmm. Okay, awesome. Okay, so we're gonna do that. There we go. There's the pesto sauce now. I gotta add some olive oil because that's what you do with pesto sauce, but I want it to be done gracefully and carefully. And so slowly. It, so I fill this up, and what's gonna happen is it's gonna pour through, see it down? Like it's falling down, beautiful shot. I appreciate that, guys. And then I'm gonna add some more in there. Now again, what I love about this is it's quick and easy. It's not taking a lot of weight. When things, when you feel like things get stuck, like you see the big, the big basil leaves, just give it a little bit of pulse, and it'll, it'll bring it down. There's an incredible centrifugal force that the power of 250 watts does that Cuisinart has brought to you. And I mean, look, I don't have anything sticking to it. I have everything putting down the centrifugal force. Now let's see what the results are of my pesto sauce. There's that handle. Pull it off. Let's look at this sauce real quick. I just want you to see. Mm. How beautiful. Look at how green that is. Look how green that sauce is. Is that beautiful? And the cheese doesn't hurt my feelings on the yeah, edge. Yeah, okay. Sorry about the yeah, sorry about the cheese. I'm fine edge. with the cheese. <laughs> we'll take it all out. But I love the fact that uh I love the fact that the blade's sitting in there and I can make sauce. Look how green, look how beautiful. Why? All fresh ingredients. And real quickly, take a look at this poppy one because this has mirepoix in it. It has yes. onions, carrot, celery. So great for stuffing. Great for stuffing, great for your holiday cooking and your prep. But look at this. It's quick and easy. So all the chopping is done for you. How great is that? And when again, with something larger, just give it a pulse because it drops down to the middle. Three cups, lightweight, 250, power, 250 watts. It's Cuisinart, folks. They're the inventor of the first food, first food, food say that five times. All right, one first more time. food processor. And now we have a three cup designed by me, not the machine, but the actual colors and the color names. So I'm all very right. proud of it. So let's take a look at those colors yep. that Mark Charles designed for you. This is pewter. Pewter. Poppy. Most poppy. popular is the poppy. Then we have blue or lapis, lapis. rather. Then jade. Then amethyst. And 900 left in your daffodil. Daffodil is fun and light and cheery. I wanted to put a smile on people's faces. This is a hand wash situation, yeah. so be sure and take some extra time just to run some, It'll be yeah, done. some quick soapy water, and you're ready to go. Mark Charles, you're back with a couple more items, Jeff. I have a home. I'm going to be here until the end with you. Oh. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff going on. Today. Maybe it's more than just two. <laughs> it is. All right.